Just a quick video on how to change the decimal 0.25 to a fraction. So here's how we do that. First thing, we'd like to get this to be a fraction. So we could just put it over one. We're dividing by one, so it doesn't change anything. It gives us the start of a fraction though. Now, what we could do, as long as we do it to the numerator and the denominator, we can change this to a whole number by multiplying. So if I multiply 10 times 0.25, that would be 2.5 but 100 times 0.25, that would give me 25, and that would be a whole number. Let's do that. 100 times 0 0.25, that does equal 25, and that is a whole number. But when we do this, we did it to the numerator, we also have to do it to the denominator. So we'll multiply the denominator here times 100, and that gives us 100 times one is 100, and now we have our fraction. And we can do this because if you think about it, 100 divided by 100, that's just one. So we're multiplying by one, no problem. So 25 over 100, we do have a fraction now, but it's not in simplest terms. So five would go into 25 and 100 evenly, but 25 would also go into 25 and 100. So that might be the best way to do it. Divide 25 by 25, you get one, divide 100 by 25, you get four. So in answer to our question, the decimal 0 0.25, that equals the fraction 1 fourth. They're equivalent. Divide one by four on your calculator and you'll get 0 0.25. Just that they're represented, one is a decimal, one is a fraction. That's it, this is Dr. B converting the decimal 0 0.25 to a fraction. The answer, 1 fourth. Thanks for watching.